I think what we're seeing with the cost of living rise at the moment is it's not our low income families that are struggling or the only ones to be struggling. This doesn't matter who the family is, it doesn't matter which road they live in in Elmbridge, it doesn't matter what their living conditions are. Every family is having to look at their budgeting, look at their income, look at their expenditures in a different way. The cost of living crisis is affecting everybody. It doesn't matter whether you're working, whether you have uh, two people working in a family home, it's affecting everyone. Um, we have uh, parents struggling on a daily basis. They struggle to put food on the table. They struggle to buy a uniform. Stories you we're hearing are heartbreaking. I mean, you know, families who, two parent families who are working, who are doing everything they can to keep a roof over their head and put feet food on the table are saying to us we never thought we'd find ourselves in this situation where we're having to ask for help, we're having to come to a charity because we have nowhere else to go. So it's not just that the financial crisis is about just food and, and energy support which we know is huge and goes across all the families, it's about the additional things that as a parent you would hope is in your gift to give and that's not there anymore. It's really tough for parents that are already struggling financially and having to choose between food and you know running that extra bath for the kids and not being able to put fuel in your car, it really like affects quality of life I'd say. So if it is at all possible, all I can ask is please can you continue to support water and charities that allow us then to be able to support the families that we do. We're all in this together, we all need to help each other and it's literally every penny counts so yeah definitely donate and let's all help each other.